In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to perform the inverted row. The inverted row is a fantastic back and postural exercise. It can be used as a regression for those of you who want to learn how to do pull-ups, or it can be used as a standalone exercise to develop strength in the posterior chain. The setup of this exercise involves you lying beneath a barbell, typically within a squat rack. Your hands should be a roughly shoulder width apart, but can be narrower or slightly wider depending on your body type. The key here is to engage your glutes and extend your hips so that there is a straight line throughout your entire body. Everything from your ankle, knee, hip, and shoulder should all be in one nice straight line with no extension in your back, no rounding in your back, just a nice solid straight posture. In the bottom position, your shoulder blades should be open. As you initiate the pull, you should simultaneously squeeze your shoulder blades together. You should set yourself up beneath the bar so that by the time your chest touches the bar, it is your sternum or the top of your abdominals that come in contact with the bar and not your chest. At the top of the repetition, your shoulder blades should be completely squeezed together and the engagement should be felt in the back and not your arms. You then lower yourself down under control while simultaneously opening your shoulder blades apart. This exercise can be regressed or progressed in many ways. If you walk your feet rearwards and have a more inclined setup, the exercise itself will be a lot easier. Alternatively, if you walk your feet forwards and place your body more parallel with the ground, the exercise will be a lot harder. You can make this exercise even more advanced by placing your feet on a bench or even wearing a weighted vest. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you enjoyed placing this exercise within your program. Please do hit the subscribe button and also click on the bell icon to get notified of our next release.